Hi Leo, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot and I am here to do your six month forecast July through December 2018. I have pre-shuffled this deck so we're not going to shuffle for very long. Um, we're going to go, um, we're going to do home, work, finances, love, your overall um, energy and we're also going to do an oracle card for each month. Um, Remember that free will plays a part, and this is a general reading, okay? So it may not, bits and pieces may not resonate with you, okay? Um, you'll be able to find the remainder of this reading on Vimeo. There will be a link below that brings you right to it for 10 bucks. So we're just going to give you a pre 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 ugh, preview right here, and we will start with that. So this first um, up here, July, August, September, and so on, home work, finances, love, overall. This is for the month of July. Okay, now we're going to move on to August. August. Home, work, finances, love, Overall, September, October, I'm going to have to move these up, I'm going to let me just to go right on up a little bit more. I do apologize. This is a pretty big spread. November. December, December, let me make sure that we can still see way up there, I'm going to do the oracle cards and then I'll zoom right in to July, okay, we're going to get these oracle cards, one for each month. Leo. This is for the sign of Leo. Leo for July. Leo for August. Leo for September. Leo for October. Leo for November. And Leo for December. Okay. All right, let me zoom on up to July and we'll get this July one started. Remember, this reading will be on Vimeo, the remainder of it, so you'll have to go there to finish it up. But July. Let's get started on that. Okay, July in your home sector is the Page of Pentacles. Okay, this is somebody that is working hard, coming up with plans. So I feel like your home is probably very, you're starting to bring security into your home. You're working hard to get things secure and stable. You still have some um, work to do, but it's coming. You're obtaining it because you're putting in the effort. Um, I think you've got a lot of focus in your home. You know, you're really focused on it as well. You're focused on making it better, you know, um, making it more comfortable, okay, because this is a Pentacles card. Pentacles are very comfortable, so um, they like it comfortable. So I'm thinking that in July, in your home sector, you know, what whatever you're doing, you're trying to make your home as comfortable as possible. You may be going through things, cleaning things out. 
Um, you, you know, you're doing work that isn't necessary, necessarily fun, but it's what you need to do to keep things structured, okay? So in your home sector, you're, you probably are giving it a lot of focus in July to get things organized, okay? So we're going to move right on to your work. In your work sector, you're probably lacking energy. You're lacking passion. It's like you, you feel like there's no growth here. You may be feeling like, I don't even think that I have energy to go to work. You know, I don't even want to go to work because this job isn't fulfilling me. It's not, I'm not passionate about it. So in July, you're lacking passion for your work, period. It's like, I, I'm, you're just not into it. You aren't. It's like, I don't, I don't see any growth here. You're feeling like you don't see any growth, okay? You want expansion, but you feel like there's no room for expansion in your work in July. It just is feeling really, um, you're stuck. You feel like you're stuck there, and you're just, you, you lack the desire to even go, right? It's like, I don't, I, don't even, I don't have any energy to go to work. I don't want to go to work. There's, I don't even care about this, that kind of thing, okay? We're going to move on to finances. Finances, we have the world card. That is a completion. That's success. So I have to tell you right off the bat, even if you do lack energy, you're still successful because you, you are your hard worker, okay? Just because you don't lack you lack the energy this month doesn't mean that that's not who you are you know we go through ups and downs it feels as though as far as your finances go you you should be feeling very successful at this time i do feel like you know there is some sort of victory here that you shouldn't be struggling financially put it that way it feels like if you were struggling that's about to end in july that you know this is this is success for hard work so I feel like even though you may lack energy, you know, you still do it. You still do it. It's not glamorous. It's not fun. I still do it. And that pays off for you. So as far as finances go, it appears that, you know, you guys are doing well. There's no struggle. There's no struggle here. That, and if there was a struggle in your financial arena, it should be ending because that world card is a beautiful beautiful card that's a new chapter so if you have been struggling financially in your finances things should absolutely start to get better in july as far as your love goes we have the ace of swords reversed this is the ace of swords is the truth but this ace of swords is reversed so as far as your love life goes you may not be feeling like somebody's being honest with you or you may be in denial. You may be not accepting the truth. Somebody is being dishonest here in your love life, whether it's you or the other person. Somebody isn't owning up to the truth. So I feel as though, you know, there, there's some communication that is needed that is lacking. There's a lack of communication in your love life, which is causing some obstacles. Because here's the obstacles. I mean, you have to put the cards together, which I'm going to continue to do through this reading. But in July, there's, there's still a lack of, of communication or truth being revealed. Somebody may be not, not telling you the whole truth. And it feels as though you may decide to cut them out even because that Ace of Swords reverse could be cutting somebody out of your life. It could be somebody has been dishonest and, you know, there's really like... some harshness around it because of some sort of dishonesty or lack of communication okay so your love life may be a little rocky in july but that doesn't mean that things are going to happen overnight okay because it feels like you know there's there's postponing okay because the two of wands reversed is postponing its fear of change and i'm looking at the cards that are next to these cards as well so i think as far as your um Overall energy, your overall energy is the two of pentacles, it's things being postponed because of fear of change. So as far as it, it, your love life being rocky, I don't think that there's going to be any sudden decisions because right now you're feeling safe, even though there's, you know, a little bit, uh, there's a lack of communication, there is, in your, in your love life. And as far as your, the other aspects, your home, work, and finances, you know, even though there's a lack of passion, I don't see any, I don't see any change because I don't see you changing much in, in July. It seems like things are going to continue along the path that they've been on, you know, because 
somebody, you may be choosing a mundane life, it's safe in July. Right now you're taking the safe zone. You're doing what you got to do to get by. You know, it's, this is the, this is the safest way. This is the safest bet just to, just to keep trudging along. In the meantime, you are headed in the right direction because you're, you're putting in effort. It's not like you're not putting in effort. You are putting in effort, even though you don't want to, you know, you don't want to put in effort. You probably don't lack the energy to do so, but you are, you're doing it because you're looking for success in your life. So it feels like, like July is a month of you know, really focusing on your home. I think you're going to really focus on your home. I feel like you're not going to make any big changes in your love life because you're, it's safe. You're in a safe zone right now. As far as your finances go, you're probably feeling pretty abundant. You should be feeling abundant. And if you're not, you're going to be. Okay? Things are going to get better as far as your finances go. Let's take a look at this Oracle card. Excess. Excess, stress, overload, exhaustion, obsessiveness, gluttony, burdens, worries, the breaking point. And you know, this does make sense. I can see, I can see that you lack energy. So th this could be at work, okay? Because that's where I see you are having the most stress. I think you're having the most stress at work and in love. Okay, as far as your home goes, I don't think your home life is that stressful. As far as your finances go, it doesn't appear that that is that stressful. And if it is, it's going to get better. As far as the overall energy goes, you're indecisive about something. And I think it's a, it has to do with your, your love life and your work life. That's where the stress is coming from. And, you know, it may be causing you to be exhausted, which we could see right here. So I feel like there is a level of exhaust and exhaustion in July. And, you know, you may reach a breaking point eventually, okay? So just keep that in mind. Look at the heaviness. Look at the rocks piled on her back. It's heavy, okay? It's heavy. I think you do. You're, you're, you're carrying a pretty heavy load here. Um, so just keep in mind that all the responsibility isn't yours. And it feels like a lot of the responsibility is on your back. So, you know, you may, you may need to... to communicate harshly, okay, to somebody. I mean, both of these aces are reversed, okay? These are ones. It appears to me that somebody is not, somebody's not helping. They're not putting in effort. And it's, and it's putting all the burden on to you. So I'm not exactly sure what this is. I also see the one, the, the uh, reversed ones tell me that there is, um, a lack of following your intuition because one 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 you know is instant manifestation these are both reversed and these are your, your negative aspects okay this is in your home and your love I feel like you're not following your intuition and it's causing some issues okay so I'm not sure what this is causing some stress so I feel like July is a month of staying in the safe zone Working through it, you know, finding finding the strength to work through it, but it is it is causing you some sort of exhaustion. But you know that doesn't mean that doesn't mean that it's going to last forever. Okay, we're going to move down. We're going to go to the rest of these. We're gonna we are going to uh, do August. September, October, November, December. Okay, stay tuned. Uh, tune into the Vimeo reading to uh, watch the rest.